and I couldn't get the weapons away from him. He would he was jabbing at me. And when he was doing that, he stabbed me in the, in the arm and here in my back. And then he stabbed me in the liver. That's what Dr. Strauss said was the worst. And that's what stopped me. And then the nursing staff and the wait, the, they were just the doctors and the surgeons. They're just impeccable. I mean, they, I had what seemed to me like ridiculous questions but they answered everything that I asked they were like, there's no dumb questions we're gonna do this at your time and they were just tremendous the physical therapists were wonderful and uh, as you can see I can stand up on my own and I'm fine now I'm gonna be okay they're taking tremendous care of me and I know that um, but I, I like to take care of myself I, I'm, I'm a doer I like to do things myself and it's a helpless feeling to have them do everything for me and they were they were telling me what they're gonna do and I, I I can't help them I just said okay do it whatever's next but dr. Akata she saved my hand she's a tremendous surgeon she's just she talked me through everything her signature is still on my pink on my ring finger if you can see it oh yeah right there she signed it to let me know which tendon that she was gonna fix hmm and originally the surgery to repair that tendon was going to be on Thursday or on Wednesday at like two o'clock in the afternoon and they came in my room at seven o'clock in the morning and they said there's an opening you want to go down and do your surgery and I said sure but I'm coming back now I'm, I'm going to be all right and I want to go back to Nazareth and I want everybody else to go back to Nazareth because we can't let people like that win you know we have to stand your ground 